Good day everyone, Aja here from Pandemonium. It is Dana's birthday, so I am gonna do some RV cooking today. I am gonna make my awesome sauce homemade meatloaf and some butter fried corn. That's what I'm bringing to the party. But I know there's gonna be other tribe members bringing stuff, but yeah, let's get to cooking. Here are all my ingredients. So the butter fried corn is simple. All you need to have is corn, you drain it, and then you put a stick of butter because I'm using two huge cans. But the butter, it's just according to how much corn you're frying up. Here's my ingredients for the meatloaf. I've got a carrot, red onion, sausage, and ketchup, breadcrumbs. Oh yeah, I forgot eggs, I gotta put eggs there. And then the meat. Now, the carrots and the onions, I fry up with the sausage and I cut it really fine. So that way there's not big huge chunks in there. And then I combine it with the meatloaf. So let's get to cooking. All right, I put in the red onions and I'm sauteing them in coconut oil. Add some pink sea salt. All right, time to dice up some carrots. I like to saute all my veggies before I put them in the meatloaf so that way they're nice and soft. I only had to use half an onion and half a carrot. It's diced up, time to add it to the pot. Alright, I'm going to let this saute for a minute and then I'm going to add in the sausage. While the veggies are sauteing, I'm going to go ahead and cut this five pounds of meat open and put it in here because I have to add the eggs and the breadcrumbs. It's a lot of dang meat. So I'm going to use three whole eggs. sea salt. It's five pounds of meat, so I'm going to use about a half a cup of ketchup, so organic ketchup. And about a cup of breadcrumbs. This is the fun part, time to mix everything in. I have too much meat, so I'm doing this in batches. I'm just gonna add some more meat to it. Ooh, it's so gooey. Alright, I just turned the burner off. The veggies and sausage are done. I'm gonna let these cool down for a second before I try to add them in. 
So I made a little hole in the meat and I just poured in the ingredients. Now I'm going to mix it around. Alright, everything is mixed in and ready to be molded. I'm going to wipe my hands off. Alright, there it is. I just have to put it on the tray and mold it. Here's my tray. Just plop it down. I know some people will find this rather disgusting. It's kind of gross, but... It'll taste good, that's for sure. Alright, it's good to go. Alright, now I'm going to wash my hands. Just catch up on top. Ooh, that sounds awful. <laughs> There's a lot of meat going on here. Alright. Go ahead and spread that out. It uh, what? I, tell you, I said it smelled good raw. I know, that's a big chunk of meat right there. I just gotta cut it on the that's oven. That's what and... she said. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Always sorry. someone with that, isn't I have it? I to throw that in there. Yeah, I know. I'm a Tim Allen fan. Okay, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna like run this the shop go, so I'll just see if you need anything over that direction. Um, I'm good. I'm just going to stick this in the oven. We were supposed to get started, but, oops, might be a little late. It took me longer than I thought. Yeah. It's going to take at least an hour. Okay, I'm going to set this in the oven. Panda colors. <laughs> I actually had to bend the pan because it wouldn't fit in my small oven, so in the oven it goes. Since I want it to be done in about an hour, I went ahead and turned it up to 425 and hopefully it'll be done in an hour. I'll check it. The corn is really easy. All it is is canned corn. You can also use frozen corn if you like, but the canned corn to me cooks up better, so I'm using canned corn. All you have to do is just drain it, and with it, I'm using two cans of this 29 ounce. So, I'm actually going to drain this. I'm going to use one stick of butter. That should be good enough. One stick of organic butter. When you first start out, even though you've drained the water, it's still a bit watery. So you wait till this all evaporates with the butter and then the butter starts frying the corn. So my organic butter is the no salt butter. I did add a quarter teaspoon of pink sea salt because I want it to stay sweet, but it's good to still have a little salt in there. So all the moisture has evaporated and the butter is now frying the corn. This is what you want it to look like. I'm gonna fry it for about 20 minutes been cooking for about 30 minutes so I'm gonna cut it down to 350 and let it cook another 30. All right the corn is done. Mmm looks yummy. The meatloaf has about 10 more minutes. That looks yummy. Mm, mm, mm. All right, time to serve. All 
All the food is ready. He probably won't get my text. And you have a good meat carver there doing the carving. Yeah, she's doing a great job. Yeah, that's it. You got it. I had part right. Come on. Did you get something to drink? Are you singing first, girl? Yeah, I remember that song. I thought you said, take it. Take another little piece of my meat, love, baby. Take another little piece of should I go on right? Yeah, just keep on going. Take another little piece of meat, love, baby. Take another little piece of meat, love, baby. So juicy. Make me so full. Oh, you do? Yeah, yeah. I'm thinking about something. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. I'm sure I'm going to speak to you now. Right. Yeah. I'm going to sing me happy birthday. to hold on so gotta find it first but here I am cause I've been laying under palm trees waiting for the summer knowing there's nowhere to go cause I am happy on this island wanna be my fun left I don't ever want to leave I'm in a tropic club ice cream wait a minute i'm not that's your birthday ice cream i can't cream. even finish this like i had two bites oh. and i can't eat anymore oh is this the amazing that's ice cream well, from across the street the sorry no i like that you though do. yeah uh, that's what i wanted so across the street there they there's an ice cream shop well what is it anyway yeah and they have the best ice cream ever mm -hmm. and it's cheap it's like 250 for a lot well small this cone is, but yeah. the small cone is huge this is like a, oh, this is large. Look at that, that's how much I I know, right? Look at that. Hot chocolate. Rain freeze, I get those all the time. Strawberry. 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 Happy birthday to you, Dana. Happy birthday to you. Make a wish. Look how pretty. Hold on. The sun's coming this way. My wish came true. Yay. Happy birthday. Oh, that looks yeah, good. Yeah, picture awaits. Happy birthday. Oh, that's awesome. That's great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to have a huge slice. Honey. Yeah, that's a huge slice. Oh, it's a right? Thank, Thank you. you. Why don't you guys come over this way? Okay. Yeah. Like this? Yeah. Oh, my God. It's strawberry inside. Oh, thank oh. you. Oh, what a treat. What's she doing cutting her own cake? She's supposed to. She's cut, you're supposed That's to your good her. luck. You're supposed to cut your own cake. Uh, you yeah, should you cut have bigger slices, though. I've never had good luck. I've and you're supposed to. Her, the first piece oh, goes to her. Okay. There we go. All right. She's got it. What, the filling on there? There's the... Yeah, I got it. Okay, so that's her piece right there. Oh, vanilla cake, vanilla icing with a little bit of cherry in the middle. Hey, Luna. Well, bye.
Bye. Oh, you're leaving? Not right this second, no. Not that, now that you got here. I know. I know. Oh, do you? Stuff. I don't know why I'm really good at it, but this isn't mine. I stole it from my uh, sister's house. Oh, okay. <laughs>